Hi guys, I'm Jess and welcome back to Magical Mystery. Now today you've probably noticed that there's a big big box in front of me and this big box contains the Disney 100 Years of Wonder Dorables. Now it comes with this big big display case and it includes 20 figures five mystery figures and it is just absolutely amazing I absolutely love it I'm going to get it out the box so you can see what the display looks like now <clears throat> this I ordered as some of you are probably aware who are a long following now as I do with a lot of my adorables. I ordered them off the American version of Amazon and had them shipped over because these items don't always come to the UK straight away um, which can be a little bit annoying if you are a collect UK collector of adorables like myself this is now, having checked recently on the UK Amazon, so I will link it down below from both sites if I remember for everyone to be able to check it out if you wish to. Now I bought this with my own money. I am not sponsored or work with Just Play in any way, even though I would absolutely love to. I am a big, big fan of their products. I love all their products. And as I have probably may have said in recent videos, I've ordered a lot more stuff. Um... So in Vlogmas there's, I think, about four videos to come and there are also some Dorables videos that will be coming out next year as well. They've released Let's Go Series 2, which is going to be amazing, it's got my boy ruin it so I need it. Um, and they've released Let's Go Series 2 of the Vehicles. As you know, I haven't covered Series 1 of the Vehicles on the channel, which I probably won't be doing till next year now, um, because there isn't the room in the schedule. Obviously, if I can make room, I will. And if I do make room, it will probably be in Vlogmas. Because I am loving everything that Dorables have been releasing. I do need to, of some of the stuff that I'm already collecting, collect um, some more boxes. Um, of series 9 definitely um, series 7 um, I do need some more series 10 um, that video that I filmed the other week will not be coming till vlogmas so make sure you're subscribed down below those notification bells are on so you're ready when vlogmas turns up I'm just going to finish getting into this and then I shall be back with you. So guys, we are in. There is, as I've just noticed, a plastic cover over the front of this. This plastic cover is protecting the shelf. 
So I think what we are going to do is take a look at all the figures that they give you. Now, counting this, we have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15 figures that you, well, that are standard that you know who you're getting. And then there are five mystery figures. You can probably tell from the back of this box, it is quite easy to identify who the mystery figures might be because I have a feeling from this that they might be fab five characters. But we will worry about when we get there. I think we are going to start on this side and we are going to pull all the figures out. That, guys, was like a real task within itself. I got all 15 of them out and had to dismantle the complete box just to get them out because they were not budging. So the first one that I did actually manage to get out the box without having to cut everything open was Jack from The Nightmare Before Christmas. Now they've all gone with Disney 100 or was and everything Disney 100 for most of them for this like silver platinum kind of look. Well, most people call it silver, but I say this is platinum. Platinum and silver do look very close together. And for things that have, Disney have described, it's platinum. Isn't he lovely? The quality on this is really good. You can see, like, a few marks in it, but they sort of blend in, really. And this one is Sally. For also from Nightmare Before Christmas. Then also in that same side, we had Elsa, who was the worst one to try and get out. She just would not let it go. <laughs> but isn't she lovely? And then to go with her, we have my absolute favourite Disney sidekick. We've got Olaf love him now I have just noticed that Olaf has got some paint at the top there that won't come off which does make me a little bit sad but it's okay then underneath that we had Miss Tinkerbell isn't she gorgeous I don't usually collect her but she looks stunning in these colours and then we have got Tiana she is gorgeous as well then right at the bottom of that side we have my two absolute favourites from this collection for some reason, my camera just cut out. But we're going again, guys. As I was showing you, this is Winnie the Pooh. And then we've got his friend, or one of his bestest friends. we got Tigger. Tigger looks so adorable in Disney Adorables. It's so cute. And then we've also in this set got the absolutely most iconic duo and friendship ever. We have got Sheriff Woody. Isn't he just adorable? And then we have got Buzz Lightyear. Oh my days. They are just stunning. Then under that we had... Miss Ariel, who is having a moment this year with her new live action. And we've got Miss Snow White. 
don't collect either of those but they are stunning then under that we have two other characters I don't really collect we have got the Cheshire Cat and we have got Simba from the Lion King and last but certainly not least we've got a must have figure for me at the moment I'm falling more and more in love with this character and this is Stitch and I am being very selective of what things I have of Stitch so at the moment I'm trying to stick to Disney Dorables and pins and that is it so we are now going to move on to our five mystery bags that came in this set and then we shall have a look at the case so these bags have all got numbers on that's just in relation to who painted it but these are numbered one to five because you've only got five figures so why don't we start with number one? Oh, good choice starting with number one he's my favourite from the Fab Five we've got Donald Duck in his little top hat there how adorable is he though so cute then we do number two oh I've oh her in this dress oh my days it is Daisy Duck so cute number three How cute is this dog though? Pluto is just adorable. Love him so much. Oh, and we've got Mr. Mickey Mouse himself. You wouldn't be able to do a Disney 100 celebration without him. Now, I do really hope, yes, I feel some ears. Of course it is, because you can't have Mickey without Minnie. And her dress, just like Daisy's, is beautiful. So these figures are absolutely stunning. Now, my favourite out of the mystery figures is definitely Donald. I absolutely love Donald in the top hat. He's smiling. It's just amazing. And my favourite, as you can probably tell, in the non-mystery figures were these two. Anything Winnie the Pooh is just a hit for me. I think it would have been absolutely stunning actually to see a Baymax in this colour. Please do Disney 100 Series 2 and include Baymax. Just, just play please. I know they're probably not watching but that's something I would absolutely love. Now this is the case that comes with it. This is the display case that you can put all the figures on. <laughs> it is absolutely stunning. It matches the colour of the figures. This is what the back looks like. And you have here, sorry if it's taking me a while to shut them off from my own world a little bit, um, is a place where you can hang them on the wall so I was worried where I would actually be able to put this but because I know I can put it on the wall I have a spot actually where it could probably go when Lewis and I are doing a bit of a move around so I think what I'm going to do is turn the camera a little bit and I'm going to set the figures up so you can see them on the shelf.
guys doesn't this stand just look absolutely incredible I love the way I've positioned them and actually the way like it looks it just looks incredible I would have happily I think if it was me had 14 figures so that the sides matched and maybe in a mystery have goofy as well for this collection i do believe that the mystery figures are the same it would have been quite nice to maybe sell it and have series 10 as some of your mysteries because series 10 have some figures relating to the disney 100 but this is just absolutely beautiful and the saga that it took to get it here to be able to film it for you guys just oh my goodness it arrived but was delivered to the wrong address so I reordered another one I have another one on the way it's coming free of charge very kindly of Amazon um, so there may be when it arrives depending on what i decide to do there may be a giveaway i may be selling there isn't anything confirmed yet but the second one is on the way and this was the one that was originally delivered it got delivered as i said to the wrong person by accident and where they dropped it off to, those lovely people came round and brought it back to us saying that it wasn't theirs. So please let me know what you thought of this lovely display. I'm going to end this video with you looking at this beautiful display because it is just absolutely lovely. I really hope you have enjoyed this video guys, if you did please give it a like, don't forget to subscribe down below and turn on that notification bell so you're notified when more magical mischief is coming your way. I really hope you enjoyed this display and this video and I'll see you very soon guys, bye!